Hi, this is Mike. Today we're going to talk about Iridium satellite communication with Arduino. You can actually send messages from an Arduino to a satellite and then process it back here on Earth. In this project I'm using a RockBlock 9603 satellite modem from Rock7 Communications. With a simple Arduino program, I use the modem to send a message up to the Iridium constellation of satellites. Iridium downlinks the message to Rock7, which then sends it over the internet to whatever server I want it to. The modem itself has a really simple serial interface, and there's a very nice Arduino library for controlling it. To make my experimentation easier, I designed a simple development board where I could put everything together. I'm using a SparkFun Sam D21 mini breakout module and an Adafruit GPS module. I added some LEDs and an OLED display so I can see what's going on. You need a clear view of the sky when doing satellite communications, so here's my portable setup for outside. I have an external antenna for the SAP modem, but the patch antenna it comes with works just fine. You need to set up an account at Rock7 to register your modem and pay for line rental and buy credits for messages, etc. This does cost money. Then you tell Rock7 what to do with the messages it gets from Iridium. You can post them over HTTP to your server or even email them. Here's my simple experiment. I'll use the pot to pick a number to send in my payload along with the GPS data. When I press the send button, the Iridium Arduino library will attempt to deliver the message and retry if needed. Now it usually takes several minutes to get a message sent to the satellite because you have to wait until one of the 66 satellites is overhead. But if you're patient and you have a clear view of the sky, the delivery will usually succeed. You can then see the messages right in your Rock7 console. Rock7 will then send the message to your destination server where you can process it. I like to use Node-RED for this sort of thing. Read the full article for the details on parsing the data. Iridium also provides some interesting metadata. I'm displaying the data on a simple dashboard. Once you've gotten the data delivered, you can do whatever you want with it. I hope this was a useful overview of using a satellite modem with a microcontroller. There's all kinds of IoT applications you might want to use this for. So see the full article at our website, notropicdesign.com. Thanks.